All right, you're all aware of the nightclub shooting by now out in Florida. And it doesn't matter what kind of club it was. You had a person go in there and shoot up people. 50 people got killed. Well, here it is. This is the breaking story now. ISIS, the terrorist, they claim responsibility for the shooting. ISIS. So, all you people out there want to take guns away from your citizens in this country, and you have these people in this country that want to kill us. You have to solve this problem. The ISIS people that are here, killing people in our country. Now, if these people in this nightclub had a gun on them, carry gun, they could have... Stop this. Maybe less people would have got killed. But they'd sit there like sitting ducks and wait for the police to show up to uh, help them. Now this is the problem in this country. Just like my state. I can't carry a gun on me if I go someplace. They don't even let it in this state. Some states you're able to carry a gun on you. Now if these people had guns on themselves inside this nightclub and some idiot comes in that wants to shoot up the place at least they can defend themselves but we see here all of these stories you people get out there and you want to do something with your gun control and all of this this is what's annoying here you got states that are defenseless we can't even carry a gun in this con in this state here okay you are ISIS ISIS is the shooter here I'll include the link on this. Yes, I want to ask you about something Senator Bill Nelson said uh, to us just a short time ago, and that is, he said, from his conversations with some in the intelligence community, they think there is a connection to ISIS. Now, he wouldn't elaborate, but I'm wondering what... I'll include the link to this story. You guys can read it. Instead of disarming your citizens... In this country, you have to arm all your citizens in this country to fight back from this group that's here. I'll quote the link.